Well, boys and girls, we're gonna do another scrapping video, guys. Um, if you guys can't tell, I'm actually at the scrap yard because I forgot to make the video. But this car I actually got from here, from my work, and basically, I'm giving it back. Um, that's kind of something I'm doing with them. They give me any scrap cars that are gonna get crushed anyways. I get the vehicle, I basically run it, have fun with it, stuff it full of stuff, bring it back, and they get whatever profit they get from it. But, so, you guys don't remember, this is the van that I ran, that my buddy ran in Hutchinson, and then I ran this at Granite City Speedway, and I think he took fifth, I took like four, but got her stuff full of a bunch of odd and end stuff, a bunch of junk. So we're basically just gonna get this thing out of here. Kind of, I didn't take any parts off of it. Um, most of the stuff that was on it was all bent and broken. I mean, I could have saved this rear axle, but I decided not to. I just decided, you know what, let's just get rid of it. Tired of looking at it cleaned up my yard so this is actually the last one that I have prepared to go in and I have two more at home that need to get cut apart which you guys will see in future videos but there you go guys uh, the cat's still on it that's something that I have to give back so so everything's on it that I got pretty much and yeah but Stay tuned guys for more future updates. Um, I got quite a few projects going on, so we're gonna be having a lot of fun. But there you go guys. There is a look at the van. The final, final look before she plays the claw game. boys and girls uh we got rid of the van and i'm just gonna add this on to uh this video i i literally just picked up all this junk i spent probably two hours i literally got right off of work got home and loaded all this junk up um well actually i loaded it up from a neighbor's property he wanted me to, yeah they wanted me to clean it up and i was down the skid loader for a while and now that I have an empty trailer and I had some other odd and end stuff at home that I was like, well, I don't want to just bring that in and I don't really want to wait for another vehicle. So I was like, well, I did promise to get a bunch of that other stuff from the property picked up and that's exactly what I did. And you guys ready to see what I all got? I got a lot of random scrap. Uh, nothing special so basically I when I was cleaning up that property before I had a load regardless the first time so I picked out two loads from that prop from this property I, I was cleaning helping clean up and basically um, so the first load I think I got like 300 bucks for the first load it, or maybe it wasn't quite that it was like 200 something so this load, I'm going to guess, is going to be around that 250 300 range is my guess. So it'll be roughly, I don't know, probably close to two tons, I think I got on my trailer. And this is just all random junk that we cleaned up. Uh, there was three old, old snowmobiles, uh, way too far gone to even bother trying to restore or even for parts. They were completely shot. So they went right on the trailer. They had a bunch of more of that pallet racking deal stuff. I don't know what it exactly is. I think it's actually uh, decking for a dock. And then they had some, a lot of uh, tubing, um, like water pipe. There's quite a bit of that there. We got that all picked up. Uh, some more docking on end stuff. Uh, my auger from the uh, from the combine that I ran 
and then like a garden tractor deal that's basically garbage and then off i think there's a trampoline set in here too and then there's like a five gallon a couple five gallon drums uh that we just filled full of junk so we got a pretty heavy or a pretty full load uh more than i thought i would actually get but there is still some stuff there but there's like trees and stuff growing around it and there and uh what else there was like there's like a truck there too that's been completely obliterated but again um i'm actually not supposed to take that until i hear from them but basically we're helping them get this stuff all cleaned up and for me spending a little bit of my time to get it, help them get it cleaned up i'm gonna make a little bit of profit or a little bit of money in my pocket but there you go guys there's a little look at uh uh what we all got going uh so stay tuned for this next little uh load that we're gonna bring in but thank you guys so much for watching all my content thank you for all the support of this channel don't forget to hit the like button subscribe button if you're new to this channel and we'll catch you guys all in the next video
Let's go. Let's go.